Welcome to Poisonous Plants 1 to 1, a story about poisonous plants told in 121 seconds. Hemlock is a word nearly everyone recognises as denoting a poison, but there are a number of hemlocks. Conium maculatum is poison hemlock. Maculatum means speckled because this is another one of the many plants that, according to folklore, was growing under Christ's cross. These speckles appear around Easter, reinforcing the link in the superstitious mind. It is said to be strongly emetic, but this does not seem to feature in some of the reported cases. There may be a difference between the whole plant and juice extracted from it. The toxins affect the peripheral nervous system, meaning that you die from the outside in. Numbing of the fingers and toes spreads until the chest is paralysed and breathing is impossible. The time for this to happen is unclear, with some stories suggesting it takes several hours. But there is no effect on the brain, so victims remain conscious throughout. The few accidental poisons that occur seem to happen when it appears in gardens and is mistaken for a vegetable, rather than resulting from foraging in the wild. The mature plant has an unpleasant smell. This is described as like mouse urine. But even for those of us not familiar with the aromatic properties of mouse excrement, it is sufficient deterrent in almost all cases. The best known victim was Socrates. It would seem that, having been sentenced to death for his teaching, Socrates was given the chance to take poison, rather than face public execution. I've always wondered if he chose hemlock, because he wanted to know what it felt like to be aware that death was imminent. For a lot more information on poisonous plants, please visit www.thepoisongarden.co.uk.